In this tutorial, I will show you the different ways you can solve the couldn't fetch error in Google Search Console. First of all, what does this error mean? It means two things. One, Google could not reach your sitemap. Two, there is an issue with your sitemap preventing Google from reaching it. Here are the steps to fix this problem. Try renaming your sitemap. Sometimes, the simplest fixes are the most effective. TO experts suggest renaming your sitemap file can do wonders if the sitemap is valid but still unreadable. Here's how. In Google Search Console, navigate to Indexing Sitemaps. Under Add a new sitemap, submit a new sitemap URL. Hit Submit and see if this resolves the issue. If the issue is not resolved, check for sitemap issues. It's time to dive deeper into your sitemap setup. Start by validating your sitemap. Use an XML sitemap validation tool to confirm your sitemap is correctly configured. Enter your sitemap URL into the tool. Click Validate Sitemap. A properly configured sitemap will return a no issues detected message. If not, address the errors highlighted. Also, ensure your sitemap lives in the root folder. Double check that your sitemap resides in the root folder of your WordPress installation. If you continue experiencing the challenge, exclude the sitemap from caching. Ensure your sitemap isn't being cached. Refer to caching plugin documentation or consult this knowledge base article for guidance. Once these steps are complete, try resubmitting your sitemap in Google Search Console. Another solution is to ensure that you submit the correct sitemap version. If the error persists, double-check that you're submitting the correct variation of your site's URL. Websites typically have four possible versions. Find the correct URL. In your WordPress dashboard, go to Settings General. The correct URL variation will appear under Site Address URL. Add the correct site URL to Search Console. If you haven't already, add this variation as a property in Google Search Console and verify it. Refer to this guide for instructions. Finally, resubmit the sitemap. Now, head back to Indexing Sitemaps in Search Console. Enter your sitemap URL in the Add a New Sitemap field. Click Submit. If the error persists, try adding a forward slash to the end of your sitemap URL and resubmit. If all else fails, it may be a waiting game. Google occasionally takes time to fetch sitemaps and in some cases, it doesn't rely on your sitemap at all. It can find and index your URLs independently. So, take a deep breath and let Google do its thing. Thank you for following up to this point. In case you need help with your SEO, feel free to reach us in the description below.